Okay, so this is the pelvic floor. This is the coccygeus muscle. These three make up the levator antimuscle, but with different divisions. This division is called the iliococcygeus division. This is the pubococcygeus division. This is the puborectalis division. This is the obturator internus muscle. It also can be seen at the back right here. Um, this is the ischiocavernosus muscle. This is this half right here is the bulbospongiosus muscle. This is the superficial transverse pernini muscle. This would be the deep transversus pernini muscle. This is the perineal body. The perineal membrane is not shown. This is the external anal sphincter muscle. This is the lab labia minora. This area would have been the vagina. This is the urethral orifice. Um, this is the clitoris the vestibular gland, and the anticoxygeal ligament. And we also have this pelvic floor model. Sorry. And this <laughs> is the coccygeus muscle right here. This is the, these three again are the levator ani muscle and the divisions. So this is the iliococcygeus division. Pubo coccygeus division, pubo rectalis division, and also be able to di differentiate um, in this area. So this is the coccygeus muscle, ilio coccygeus, pubo coccygeus, and pubo rectalis. The obturator internus muscle, right here. Um, ischio cavernosus muscle and this is the bulbospongiosus muscle this is the superficial uh, transverse pernini per muscle deep transversus pernini muscle perineal perineal body perineal membrane external anal sphincter Labia minora, the vagina, urethral orifice, clitoris, vestibular gland, and endococcygeal ligament.